Tom, I want to take you back a year to this race last year. You win your record-breaking seventh Le Mans, and you come up on that podium, and I'm sure you've seen the television pictures, sea of faces turned up and cheering. What went through your mind when you stepped out there on the podium? A lot of things go through your mind. It's a, it's a peak experience in your life. And obviously, um, yes, my little mind, but there's so much uh, energy, so many people involved in, in having a victory at Le Mans. And last year, obviously, for champion racing, uh, bringing the American flag back on, back on uh, top was, uh, was a new, unique experience. It's like anything in life. If you can't share it with anyone, then, it's, uh, then success doesn't mean a lot. So was that race perhaps the most special of the seven victories for you here? I have a phrase saying that you can't choose between your children, can you? And, um, but without the first, the others wouldn't come, probably. And um, 97 was the first time I, I really noticed the importance of the race by being here. I haven't been here before. That was one week before the, before the race. Uh, there was a rain in 2001. There was a traditional make uh, driving with, uh, with Bentley in 2003. But obviously, uh, last year, from what we had to do and from where we came from, and, uh, and it was a real classic, uh, classic fight in a way. So uh, it's the one I remember the most, uh, I would say, but all are very important to me, and I have a lot of uh, nuances and, uh, from, from, all the, from all the races. How has your life changed since you won Le Mans for the seventh time? Has there been a difference in, in your life back home and on the road? Things has changed, but probably not as, um, as, um, as it will maybe even later. I don't know, but if you look back in the history, you, you know how much it, it means to, to be here. And you feel it when you're here, and I, I enjoy being here. And obviously I'm aware of that, uh, but we are in here with a new program. We are with a diesel engine, the TDI, and uh, I'm here for a reason, and that's what I'm, I'm concentrating on. But for sure I feel uh, recognized, I feel respected, and of course these are things I've fighted for since I was uh, a little kid doing go-karts. You're 38 years old now. How long do you see yourself doing this? You know, it's, it's, um, I love uh, motorsport, I love racing. That's what brought, uh, brought the motivation and brought me here in the first place. I still love to be a part of this process, of this unique atmosphere it is to be with with, uh, with real men in, this, uh, in the racing world. And I, um, I love that, so I can't put any figures on. I can easily say five years, because that means that in two years' time you will have forgotten the answer.